I can't fuck with snakes. I ain't all the way back for my people. I pray I was I ain't. for fame. I'm finna turn up and get they ass a taste. I thought taste. I was global. They screaming my name. I'm everywhere like I'm the Chicago way. Way. Or anything. Um, I, I got up with Lil Chris. He was basically telling me how he was around Lil Fo when he was first starting this shit. And you, you was there too. Yeah. It was him, Kid Wonder, and himself. Like, he and Kid, but he was one of the main ones that was really helping Lil Fo out with, like, this. Everybody was there. helping Lil Fo, bro. Because when you got, when you got to stop player like that, everybody gonna pitch in and do they. I can't get one motherfucker the credit for helping Lil Fo. That's why that, that little. Debate that was going on. I seen that late, but I really, I'm, you know, I was mm. around for that shit. So, like me, I helped him. Kid helped him. Lil Chris helped him. And mm. it's little folk not for let everybody help him though neither though. So, it it was a lot of niggas that was around us that was rappers that couldn't help him. And one thing they was cloud chasing, but we really trying to help bro out. So yeah, and then, niggas was just using their studios, using their beats and all that. That don't mean you made a nigga. And even like on the right on the writing tip, like niggas be saying, oh, you roll all folks and nah, bro, that's a cap. You know, cause you, say we in the studio, right? Right. You got four bars, and you can't come up with shit else. I'm I'm right here with you, freestyling. And he, yeah, say that. I'm freestyling, but I'm telling you to say this shit. That don't mean I'm writing it. I'm just telling you to say this. Right. It done been times where I done walked in the booth and paused that shit. Hold on, no, nah, folk, put some aggression in that shit. Cause we was at a certain level. You know, I couldn't let that shit be on there, but. The four ass wrote all you wrote all this shit, a lot of all this shit, but there done been times where I done had raps and he'll be like, let me hear what you got. And I'll rap the sheet. You should let me say that. I'm here. That's how I learned how to freestyle. Oh word. I gave him my rap. And I and it was my turn to rap. Mm. And I ain't know I ain't know what the fuck I was gonna say, so I just said punch me in. And that was in like uh 2016. Mm. I ain't gonna lie. That's when we made Lose Me. That yeah. Lose Me joint. I don't, think I, I don't think I heard uh, a lot. And I heard a lot. Yeah, I heard a lot. Yeah, real, real yeah that. But I ain't gonna lie. Everybody, everybody really played their role in that shit. But yeah. folk get all the credit. I got all the credit yeah. to him. Him play himself. All right, man. Cause he was. Cause Chris ain't no, ain't no nigga, ain't no, ain't no nigga, ain't no one specific motherfucker help little folk get on. Not one. If it's all the team effort, even when Lil Chris was helping him, I was at Lil Chris' crib with them. Yeah. Yeah, I was over there. We was all the same type of motherfuckers. Um, me and Lil folk. We, yeah, I used to go over there to watch Bro back anyway. Yeah. You know, cause we all we all from out west, but you know how that shit be. Yeah, but no one was a yes man when it came down to Lufo, right? What you mean by yes man? Like, with, like when Chris was telling me how he was around Lufo and everything, he said Fo wanted yes man, cause like it was times like he said Lufo wanted no yes man. No, wanted yes man around him. Cause younger than Lufo liked it uh, when he started to blow up. I just let him know, like man, be the same, you know, be the same, stay home. I don't want it to be like a stay on him, like Big Brother on him. Mm -hmm. Get on him when he's doing something wrong. He's doing something he ain't supposed to do. Mm -hmm. All right, he got bigger, he ain't used to like that so much. He just liked this yes man around him, like the people who ain't gonna tell him right from wrong. Mm -hmm. And I don't want that to still do that. So, you know, um, shit, he just got with some kids. I guess they been, yo, these little crews no more branched off. Stop checking on me, calling me, Damn. talking. You know, so then I'm like, look, bro, what's up, Joe? Started making problems. I'm like, damn. Got like that, I got a little angry. You know, I was talking shit on some interviews, but you know, we was young. And um, you know, I regret all that talking shit on them. I was a little angry. I felt like I put my all into somebody and they uh, switched up. That, that'll get you angry, you know? When they, when you got the key now to our dreams to get bigger, you got the key from all our help. So I feel like you the one could have made this bigger. I guarantee you, if I'd have still been in that circle, we'd be just as big as uh, any T Grizzlies or Dirt now. Because I was the brains and a voice and keeping everything structured together. So like when I did this act TV interview, I told people I'm like, um, the music not gonna sound the same. And things not gonna be the same when I ain't that no more, you know. It's gonna flow down, and eventually that's what the fuck happened, you know. If you can see it for yourself, they was on the comments, he hating, he hating, fat boy hating, and all that. But I told y'all, you know, it take a team to do shit, you know, brains and structure. 
He like, wanted yeah, yes man around. Yeah, because yeah, there was times where he would, where Lufo would do something, but he was trying to tell him the See, right. See, I, I always been my own man. That's and Chris, he said that too. He said, "No, nah, you always be your own man." But he did I, 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 I want to say that he wanted yes man around, but you know how that shit be when, like, when a nigga got the, when a, when a nigga, that's like LeBron right now. Like with LeBron, it ain't that they yes man. They just gotta play their role. Oh yeah, tight shit. So I don't, I don't think nobody was going on yes man shit. It probably a lot of motherfuckers that, that rappers that was kind of trying to come around and, and try to get some free features and shit. They yeah. probably was dick riding and yes man it, but all right, that's probably what he was talking. I don't know, about, but you know, folk got his own crowd too. He right, got his own crowd of niggas and shit. I, don't, I, I can't say they were yes man because these the same niggas he a call. What you want, folk? Pull up to the stool. Let's get high, bitch. What you want? So you calling them? So how the fuck they yes man it? And then, yeah, but Lufo, yeah, he, he, that's how he is, though. If you tell him no, you want to get into it for real, just for that day. It had been times, nigga, it had been times, nigga, where he had a show and I had something to do. He, man, how the fuck you ain't going to go to the show with me, man? What's up, man? Nigga, I can't go. I got shit to do. The <laughs> fuck? He, all right, man, your ass tweaking on the floor. You tweaking, I'm, all right, nigga. This sound like he had angry issues, too. All right, kind of, we kind of, yeah, what? We went hand in hand with that shit, like, yeah. All right, well, I don't play that. Alright. Like yelling at me shit. Yeah, yeah no. Nah. But alright, new topic. Now when it comes down to Chicago overall, we got a lot of niggas that's rapping this shit. We got niggas that's G's, we got niggas that's B's, we got niggas that's stones, we got niggas that's neutrons. One thing that people keep trying to tell me is that the foes is underrated or overlooked because we don't got a lot of foe rappers out here. And I'm like, Batman's a prime example of this shit. Man, Man. we got the the, the the foes got the they got this shit right now. All right, man. Then let's give credit where it's due. Yeah. The All foes. the top four rappers right now that man, we need nigga. to pay attention to, let me know. The ones that's out. Got this shit busting. Shit. Me, DCG, uh, Von off 1700. Von uh, Hey, the L block. Oh. That's four now. Yeah. Oh, that's another thing I have to learn about. See, I'm from my south. I, I ain't from my west. But uh, one thing uh, I learned. Hey, I want done, though. Pronto. Oh, Pronto spaz out. Mm -hmm. Of course. So, I mean, I can keep going. These motherfuckers, we, it's a lot of faux rappers, but you know, we not, we not, you know, foes the, or the out west rappers, I'm gonna say the out west rappers, they not in the media with with heavy beef. You know, niggas out south got famous ops. Like, they ops got a name. Everybody out west, they ops ain't known. So, oh, motherfucker, okay. that's why motherfuckers be like, oh, who this person into it? Who this person into it? Because you don't fucking know they ops. Right. These niggas be having like fucking 300 followers and shit. So do you think if niggas was from out west was to glorify they beast, they, it would have been more worldwide? Hell like how yeah, else? hell yeah, yes. The more you diss, the more you get up there, cause motherfuckers mm. want to see depths behind this shit. They want to see the the downfall of that shit. They want to see you put the belt on the ops. They want to see you do that shit. You know what? If, if I'm being honest with you, there's only one person who was actually dissing niggas and shit, and he ended up passing. May he rest in peace. From where? The same game. Oh, oh brother. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, uh, that's what happened. Yeah, you can't base your career off this because you still got to go places. Yeah. Like, you pop, pop your shit, though. Talk your shit. Say fuck whoever, but you don't make no whole song and put they name in a title. Yeah, he, yeah, he made numerous songs. He made numerous songs. Yeah. Though. And that, that was the thing. Yeah. That mm -hmm. shit real, though. Wait, wait. Oh, yeah, another thing. Fans got on your, fans got on your ain't way. No, no, ain't nobody ever got on my ass. Nobody. Okay, okay, let me correct They want fans, they want even my fans. Fans was mad at you because a cameraman died from Chicago. And yeah, and they don't even know the backstory, and I never had the time to explain it. What really went down, he shot, and that wasn't even no diss to him. He shot three diss songs about me. What? Yeah, the nigga Tiger Sane was dissing and shit. Somebody gonna keep me and shit. I, seen, I actually seen the nigga Tiger Sane after the diss song, he was scared. See, I, see, I never heard that diss. I would've known. Right, cause he, now, now you see what I'm saying, how we'll be way more bigger if I, I said clout. Mm. But folks, he knew his ass cause he was over there shooting all his videos. And did he try to shoot your video before? Or he yeah, actually, yeah, he reached out to me. And I told him, I, and that's another thing I ain't explained. He reached out to me and I told him that. I told him that. Like, nah, bro, you, no disrespect though. You shoot for dude shit, you just shot a diss song. But he tried to explain like, nah, I ain't in that shit. So I ain't never put him in that shit though. That's what motherfucker got fucked up. They always want to, that's Chicago. They want to find a way to, if you ain't got nothing bad on your name, they're going to try to put something better. Who the fuck going to push up on me? I heard a nigga say I can't come out with my bitch. <laughs> bitch, what the fuck I want to about with? My motherfucking baby go to school with. What the fuck is you talking about? Who the fuck got on my ass and I'm still walking through this bitch carefree? <laughs> yeah. Come on, man. I, yeah. I smack, and there was a lot of bitches too, though. But you know, people be getting they feelings. These probably people cuz, uh, uh, well, uh, that's the nigga, but I'll smack one of them hoes on Pierre Gray on my son. I'll smack one of them hoes, 
and any one of them niggas that was talking crazy, beat it, brother. Niggas don't got whips, guns, none of that shit. I don't, I, I don't troll back when niggas want to. So you okay, call it. Okay. I don't think they got on my eyes. But that shit only lasted for one day. Yeah, it did. It did only last. That shit died last so word. quick because it's like I didn't feed into it. Yeah, exactly. And no, I said, say what the fuck I said. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. Even even some of the foes were saying I was I was I was petty for that, but I still said what the fuck I said. Yeah, and I one thing about you, you don't take back what you say. I'm not man. Why, why would I say it? <laughs> hey, <laughs> hey, look, hey, look though. See, I'm someone who's in the media. And I don't know. If, I don't know if you be promoting niggas and shit, or you be doing such fine time with like that from time to time. But I be promoting niggas and shit. Niggas will say a lot of shit on the internet that they don't mean, and then they ask me. No, they say a lot of shit on the internet that they wouldn't even say out their motherfucking mouth to a motherfucker. Exactly. See me, I see motherfuckers. Say, hey, boy, come here. Let me holler at you. And that's the difference. I don't. That, that's the first thing these niggas do. Going in there, I got two phones. I'm still not gonna just run to this bitch and respond. I'd rather respond in person. Exactly. I'm gonna come over there. Like, I ain't gonna lie. Me and Yellow, me and King Yellow, we not into it no more. All right.